My name is Natasha and I love spending my time outdoors. On this video I'm camping in the wilderness of Samothraki, one of the most lush and wild islands of Greece. I will be spending the next few days up in the mountains where only few dare to go, a place that's not even in Google Maps. But of course, everything starts by taking the ferry from the port of Kavala in North Greece. Amen. After a couple hours on board, we arrive on the island. Straight away we jumped into a local's 4x4 truck that took us to the beginning of the trail. Trekking this trail with a heavy backpack, it's a challenge, but the view makes everything worthwhile. Haven't been in Samothraki for two years. This is a new adventure. Every time you're away, I long for you so much I can find my way. We got everything to stay alive and the time that we share makes it all worthwhile got this place on do you feel like we got something strong someone like you a little bit because the sun is going down and we have to set camp before it gets too dark and um, yeah let's hope we find a nice spot and uh, my friends here are mocking me because I'm talking to a camera <laughs> I think this is gonna be camp for the night I think it looks good right I think what we have to do is set the tents, make a fire and eat. I'm so hungry and we'll see what's in the menu. This is the view from our camping spot not too bad. We have a whole mountain, a pool, a river, and that's it. Not too bad. Hey, I just came up here to find some light because it's super dark. I want to say the tent done. And we don't have to make a fire because we just met some people from Puerto Rico and they invited us to their camp spot so we can eat, we can wait, I'm so hungry <sighs> everything's so good I have a classic as always I have a stick in my hair <laughs> so tonight we're having a dinner party at our neighbor's house here this is a their summer house it's an amazing view you can see hmm? isn't it grey? Very kind of them to invite us. Don't oh. want your food to fall down. It's a miracle you and I find. Today on the menu is quinoa with uh, tahini and nutritional yeast and um, spices, that's it. The next morning we started the day with some qigong practice. 
The mountains here are timeless and glorious. Later, I headed to one of the pools to swim and relax. These are the springs of Funyash River. The water is so pure and cold here that makes you return to the island over and over again. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Pack our bags and get in that car. Leave a little note and we'll drive real far. Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair. We can look back someday. Baby, don't you understand? That we only get one life away. After I spent some time by the river, my friends called me to go on a short trek. The goal for the day was to go at the top of the mountain. But we just made it here because we're a bit tired and very hungry. So we're going to go to the camp and uh, eat something and possibly swim again in the pools. Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I wanna make a kill Come on now and take my hand Yeah, we only get one Now it's time for some rest Hmm So in the morning, I went to one of the pools to have a swim. Coming out of the pool, I slipped. I put my foot in a rock with slime. Even though I was careful, I fell and I hit my head here. And uh, if it wasn't for my hands holding my body, I would have hurt a lot more. Maybe seriously injured. So guys, be careful here at the pools. It's very slippery. Even though you can be careful, you can fall. And uh, just when we were coming, I saw a guy that cut his leg and he said he was going to the hospital because he got infected. So be careful, don't do the same mistake as I did and don't fall. Now I'm a little bit careful to go back into a pool because I was shocked from the fall. But uh, I will try and overcome it and get back in because it's so beautiful here. The water is so refreshing. It's like oh it's cold it makes your body feel good after training and walking and hiking the water just calms you down and the muscles are rested perfect and it's quite hot today so i will try not to be scared go back to the water let's go
this is quite good for a fire. Tree bark, if it's dried, it's epic. This branch, you can see, it doesn't have any leaf, so it means it's a dead branch. So if I cut it, it won't be a problem for the tree. Look how easily it snaps. So the best place to find wood is on the trees, because they're not lying in the ground and having any humidity. And this dead branch is perfect. It's a perfect example of a wood fire. <laughs> Well, that's it for today. Thank you all for sticking around till the end. See you next time.